Did your Fire Stick just flash a What's New Fire TV tour? Well, if it did, there's a fresh update rolling out that quietly unlocks a few tricks to make viewing simpler, clearer, and a lot easier to jump straight into what you want to watch. And let's be honest, most Amazon updates shuffle things about or break something, but this one actually helps. These tweaks save time and genuinely improve day-to-day -day streaming. Stick around and I'll show you what changed, what to turn on, and a couple of sneaky shortcuts that make movie night feel upgraded without spending a penny. Let's dive in. First up, the continue watching row is front and center on the home screen. It's your recently obsessed with shelf that pulls the films and episodes you've started and lines them up so you can jump straight back in. No ad hopping, no detective work. If it isn't showing everything yet, you can refresh it in a few taps. Open settings, go to account and profile settings, choose sync Amazon content, then head back to the home screen and give it a moment to update. Next up, the universal watch list. If you're forever saying, I'll watch that later, and then forget what that was, this fixes it. When you're highlighted over any title, press the options button on your remote and choose add to watch list. Now this works across Prime Video and participating apps, which is supported and varies by app and region. To find everything you've saved, go to the top menu on the home screen and open My Stuff, where you'll also see your purchases and rentals. Your watch list and purchases sync across all your Fire TV devices so you can access and watch anywhere. Now, time for a quick pause. Drop a comment with what's on your watch list right now and why other viewers should check it out. Think of it as your mini recommendations for everyone watching. If you're enjoying this video, tap like so more Fire TV key users can find it. Now, here's a genuinely useful upgrade, Dialogue Boost. It enhances the vocal range so speech cuts through background music and effects making conversations clear even at low volumes or on built-in TV speakers. You can enable it in settings, accessibility, dialogue boost, then choose a level based on your room and speaker setup. Start at medium and adjust it until voices sound natural. Now, many titles also include a dialogue boost audio track in the audio subtitles menu. Select it there for the same result right inside of playback. You should notice cleaner voices on talky scenes, fewer volume spikes during action and less need for subtitles. If you travel or bounce between sketchy Wi-Fi networks and apps get moody, a consistent connection helps a ton. Now, I use NordVPN on my Fire Stick when I'm away from home to avoid random hotel throttling and to keep streaming traffic private. My NordVPN link is in the description if you want the same setup. If one of these features hasn't appeared yet, don't panic. Updates roll out in waves and some integrations vary by region. Keep your device updated, do that quick content sync and it should land. So yes, this Fire TV update actually helps in day-to-day -day use. Continue Watching puts your in-progress shows and films front and centre, so you're two clicks away from where you left off. Universal Watch List keeps every save for later in one place and synced across your Fire TV devices. And Dialogue Boost makes voices clean and easy to follow without raising the volume or reaching for subtitles. Thanks for watching. If this helped, hit like and make sure you're subscribed with notifications on. Follow me on X for tips and quick fixes. Subscribe to my second channel, Tanda's Tech, for broader gadget reviews. 
And if you want direct support, join channel memberships to get access to our private group chat. Thanks again and enjoy the update.